In a city, most people buy food in a market that may look like this. In such a market, they can buy many different kinds of fruits and vegetables. This kind of food is called produce. The produce is sprayed with water to keep it... Where does this produce come from? Why does it cost money? To find out, we'll follow one kind of produce. This farmer is working in his field preparing to plant carrots. He had to buy the machines he uses, and he had to buy the carrot seeds these workers are planting. After only a few weeks, the seeds have sprouted into tiny green plants. Gradually, the carrots grow large enough to be harvested for market. Now the farmer must hire men to help harvest. The farmer must pay for the machines the men use, and he must pay the men for the work they do. These farm workers must be skillful to operate the complicated harvesting machinery. To get the money he needs, this farmer sells his carrots to a company that processes food. At the processing company, the carrots are carefully washed. Some of the carrots are put into a slicing machine. And then they are frozen. Another machine seals the frozen carrots in plastic bags 
ready to be delivered to market. But not all the carrots from the farm have been frozen. Fresh, whole carrots are also put into plastic bags. The carrots are weighed on scales so that each bag will contain the same amount. An inspector weighs some of the bags again to make sure that customers will get as many carrots as they pay for. The owner of the processing company must pay his workers and pay for the machines that clean, slice, and package the carrots. To get the money he needs, he sends the carrots to the city to be sold. A truck driver delivers the carrots to the wholesale produce market in the city. Many workers are needed to unload all the trucks. Every day, many kinds of produce are delivered to the wholesale market. Here, men called wholesalers buy produce from farmers and processing companies. The produce is put on display for buyers that come from supermarkets, restaurants, hospitals, hotels, or school cafeterias. This wholesaler is selling produce to a buyer from a supermarket. Some of the carrots that came from the farm are loaded onto his truck with other produce to be taken to the supermarket. Only buyers who need large amounts of produce shop at the wholesale market. To get the produce they need, the people that live in the city need the help of farmers, help of farm workers, the help of workers in processing companies, the help of workers in the wholesale produce market, and the help of workers in the supermarket.
Every worker can be paid for the job he does because people pay for the produce they need. Thank <laughs> you.